Hey guys, Papa Rooms here. Today we're doing another unboxing of the Eight Man Cabela's Alaskan Guide Model tent. Good four season tent. And we're gonna do an unboxing, set it up and check it out. Stay tuned. So we're doing an Adirondack trip and my brother just picked up this tent. I have my hot tent on the way and I have my LL Bean, which you've seen in a lot of my videos, a six man. But I've always wanted this eight man Alaskan tent and he got it. So we're gonna do an unboxing here, set it up before we do our trip in a few weeks. You know the weight? It's about what, 50 pounds? I think it was 41 or 44 pounds. Definitely one of the heavier tents I've ever gotten. Got it? All right. All right, so I have other reviews on tents, by the way, but uh, we're gonna check this one out too. You can check out the rest in my playlist here. So it comes with a repair guide, care guide, and instructions. Repair kit also, so that's cool. It's nice that they give you a big bag and the material feels durable already. We're gonna be using this tent in a few weeks up in the Adirondacks. It's pretty close to the uh, LL Bean, but it is a bit bigger. We'll find out. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put this on time lapse here and we're gonna check it out and then I'll go over the setting up, the pros, the cons, what we like about it, and we'll go from there. Check it out on the inside too. Okay, so just real quick, I wanted to show where a lot of the weight was. I mean, the tent isn't too, too heavy, but the material is a lot thicker. But the weight is, they are heavy duty stakes. I'll show you what one looks like. These are super heavy duty, heavy weight, and they're like foot long. Uh, reason why it's a big tent, so you're gonna wanna have enough support. But also, if you look at the poles that we have, they're thicker as well than a normal tent that I would normally have. Mind you, it is an eight person, so you're gonna want it beefed up. They look pretty good. Yeah, the winds on these are rated really well. I'm glad you bought it. I've been wanting this tent forever. Now you can so. borrow it. And <laughs> I can take it. I got like 12 tents. I don't even know. I need another one. All right, so we probably spent what, 15 minutes? About 15 minutes here. And we got this part set up. We're about to put the rain flap on. And I'm trying to do this without even looking at instructions. We've put together tents our whole lives. And it's probably the most secure tent we've ever had. They crisscross, they interlock. They're heavy duty. Everywhere you, where they crisscross here for support, you have another Velcro. Plus you have where your guy lines are gonna tie in. You have your loops, they're all you know stitched in here seems sealed and this is all ripstop material so if you get a tear it won't continue um the other good thing about this is it's all ykk zippers as you know i don't have to say anything about that and let's check out inside real quick tons of room way way bigger than my six man i understand now why this is an eight man and all your weight is in the poles and in the stakes that it comes with so if you were going to go with like multiple people you just have them carry that and one carries the tent. You want to go in to show the difference of room? I'm going to keep standing here and I'm six feet tall and I don't touch the top. I got a foot space from this. Yeah, you got tons and tons of room in here. I mean, lay down on the floor and just show me from that side over how far. What I really like with this is it's got built in drink holders. <laughs> you mean for your uh, soda and water bottle? Yeah. Yeah. Lay down. I want to see how much room. I mean, <laughs> that's one of him. He's like six feet tall. Plenty of room here. So awesome, awesome. I always wanted this tent. Yeah, it's got complete, complete, you have stuff everywhere that can hang in. It's got more guy lines on here to tighten it up if you want. And it has compartments individual for everybody all the way around. Sweet, sweet tent. So we're all complete. I'd say about 20 minutes into setting this up and we never even looked at the instructions. We just kind of went for it. Um, so you have the front here, which is really nice. Uh, we're not gonna stake everything in cause we're gonna be taking this right down immediately. But what we wanted to do is just kind of do a run to see how this tent is gonna look, how it's gonna set up. So when we get to camp, we don't have to, you know, fumble. We know the setup of it. Big, big bonus on top of everything else that is high quality with the zippers, the rip style material, the waterproof ability. Right here on the guy lines, they are out of metal. They're probably aluminum. So if you notice here, you have upper and you have lower guy lines. And that's a big deal if you're in high winds, like with this that they use for Alaska. They use this for the 
uh, extreme conditions and high winds. I think the wind was what? Like 50 to 60 mile an hour. The other thing that was really cool is on my LL Bean, my other tents I have, the rain flap is always usually a buckle, but these are off a bungee and a clip and they go right to the base here. So it's, uh, you know, we didn't even pull it all tight, but that's, they pretty much going to here, I'm assuming. You have double doors here. We have another door on this side here that we could open up. We have a window on the opposite side. And all in all, it looks really good, this tent. That would go down. That's what it looks like the center. So it, the front vestibule would be all the way down on the ground here. I think we're ready for, for camping. I mean, hell, I wouldn't even need my tent. Has a lot of room, and because of the way it's shaped here and the structure, it allows you to breathe through all the vents here, but the rain is not going to come through hail or snow. I think you said, what, five inches of snow it could handle? Yeah, it'll handle a decent amount of snow as well. And uh, that's it. So really, all in all, with this tent, I don't have any complaints about it other than it's heavy with everything. But I mean, you're not looking at a packable tent here. You could pack it if you have mule or whatever, but it's not like a backpacking tent. But it is a great buy. Uh, retail, I don't know, what, what was this, uh, 400, 500? 500 they yeah, they had a Father's Day sale, so we got a little money off here. But I really don't have any negatives other than it's just heavy if you're going to backpack. But we didn't get it for backpacking. Well, hope you enjoy our future adventures. Hope you guys like this video. Stay tuned because we're going to have a lot of videos up and coming with this up in the Adirondack Mountains on a lake. Check out my channel playlist. I have a lot more videos on different product reviews coming out for camping this year. You don't want to miss it. Don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and leave a comment, guys. Take care.